If you're in all my business, you know that creating marketing graphics and social media content can take forever and hiring designers is expensive. But here's what most people don't know. Google Labs has this free AI tool that can scan your website, build what they call a business DNA, which is basically a digital fingerprint of your brand's colors, fonts, tone, and visual style and then automatically generate unlimited marketing creatives that match your brand perfectly and in a matter of minutes. Today, I'm showing you five ways to use this tool called Pomeli that will completely change how you create content in your business. And if you implement even one of these strategies, you're gonna save hours every week and never have to stare at a blank Canva template Again, if you're new here, I'm Rick Mulready, and over the past 12 years, I've helped thousands of online businesses grow and scale their business, and I'm the founder of the AI Playbook community, where I help online entrepreneurs work less and make more money with AI. Okay, so first, you're gonna find Pomeli in the Google Labs website, so labs.google. I talked about this in a, actually a lot, in a recent uh, video here on the channel. So if you've never been to Google Labs, definitely check it out. There's a whole bunch of experimental tools that they have in here that are totally free to use as a Google user. And right now, as I'm recording this, it is the feature tool right here at the top. So if I click on try it now, you'll come to this screen here and it'll show you the three different sort of stages, if you will, that make up Pomeli. Generating your business DNA, getting campaign ideas, and then generating the creative for those specific campaign ideas. And so for use case number one, I wanna use Pomeli to do a brand clarity audit. So I am redesigning my website right now using Lovable. And I've published it, it's not done, but I've published it for what I've created so far. So I'm gonna go ahead and paste in the URL of the new website. So right now, Pomeli is analyzing the website, gathering the colors and the brand values, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, and here's the result of the analysis, what it calls your business DNA. So it uh, picks out the fonts, it picks out the brand colors, uh, any images, literally I only use two images right now. And then also if I scroll down here, you'll see the tagline. So the tag, the current tagline on the website, this is correct. The It's extracted the brand values, brand aesthetic, brand tone of voice, and the business overview. And now that we've got the business DNA, we can use it as a brand clarity audit, right? So if you are launching a new marketing push, for example, which is exactly what I'm doing with the new website, we've just run the new website through Pomeli to see how an AI interprets my brand and my colors and voice, et cetera. Well, if the AI suggests that tone of voice or brand values feels off, it's a red flag that your website messaging, for example, is gonna be inconsistent with creative that you wanna create. So before we create any kind of creatives with this for the next use case here, I can go in and make changes. I can add a logo, I can upload additional images, I can use AI to generate images. I can click on the edit for brand values. I can add in new brand values. I can take out something that I feel like doesn't fit for whatever reason. So for this, let's just say that the audit is a success. I feel good about this. Now I wanna click on looks good. And after clicking let's go, it takes you right into the campaign creation process here. So I can use suggest ideas right off the bat. I can type something in here, which is exactly, exactly what I'm gonna do, or it's giving you suggestions already. So if I click on that, it's gonna show me these four graphics here that I didn't have to create, it created for me. Now, are they the best looking graphics? No, but what I can do with this is I can start editing them if I want to. So I can click on, let's just say I wanna click on uh, this right here and I can click on fix layout. I can go to the image. I can change the image if I want to, add a new image. I can go to the header and change the, the text. I can change the font. I can change the description. I can add a CTA to this. Before this next use case, I wanna tell you about this tool I've been using. A 2026 resolution of mine is to get organized with everything that I read, watch, and write. That's why I'm using Recall. Recall is a personal knowledge base that automatically organizes and connects everything that you save. Using their browser extension or mobile app, you can summarize and chat with YouTube videos, articles, PDFs, and even TikToks with just one click. And it's more than just a bookmarking tool. You can add rich notes, tables, and to-dos, keeping everything now in one place. And best of all, you can actually chat with your knowledge. 
instead of generic AI advice, you can ask Recall to build a January productivity plan based specifically on your saved resources and your journals and notes. It even builds a visual knowledge graph to show how your ideas connect as they grow. Make 2026 your most productive year yet. Try Recall for free at getrecall.ai or use code RICK25 for 25% off the unlimited version this January. For use case number two, let's create a lead magnet promotion series. And I'm gonna use the following prompt here in Pomeli, create a multi social media platform campaign to promote my lead magnet. And I'm just giving a very light description of my lead magnet. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on generate ideas. Okay, so it's just generated three new angles for me for this lead magnet campaign. Let's go ahead and click on this one here. Okay, so it's just generated these images for me. And again, I can click into each individual one and make any kind of changes to it. I can also add more creative to the campaign. So I can click on add creative and describe the creative that you want to make. I can say image, story, header, description, generate. So let's go ahead and click on story and I'm gonna keep the nine by 16. I'm gonna click on generate and it's just giving me this automate 50% of your week. Don't love it. it, looks very stock. But again, this is giving me a great starting point from which to work. Now, Pomelia has just recently added an animate feature. But let's just say I wanna animate this image right here. I can just click on animate and it will generate a new image. Okay, it's just finished creating the animated version of this image here. So let's see what it's added. Oh, it's added like this ripple effect. Um, okay, I've done others where it moves my arm. It looks kind of weird, but bringing some movement to the image could work really well for doing split testing with ads, for example, which we're gonna talk about in the next case study. All right, for this next use case, we're gonna use Pomeli to do a promotion or create a promotion for a hyper niche landing page. Let's just say you have a new offer and you wanna create marketing assets that you can use to promote your offer. So what you'll do is instead of giving Pomeli your entire website URL, you'll give it the URL of a specific landing page. And for this use case, I wanna use my buddy Pat Flynn's uh, landing page for his short form formula program, which is amazing by the way. So I'm gonna put the URL of that landing page in here. So I'll click continue. And again, it's gonna create the business DNA of that offer and landing page. Okay, and here is the business DNA that it has created for that offer and that landing page. So here's all the images. Obviously, he's got a lot of images on the on the page. Here is brand colors, brand tone of voice, business overview, brand aesthetic. Okay, cool, all that looks really good. So again, we can move on to step two by clicking on let's looks good. Okay, again, so because I wanna create specific content for that offer of the landing page that I gave it, I can go into the campaign uh, prompt here, if you will, and say, I wanna create a campaign that sells the short form formula program, focus on pain points the audience has and why the program is the solution. So I'm gonna click on generate ideas. Again, it's gonna give me three different angles, if you will, for content that I can choose. Okay, awesome, it's giving me three from camera fear to content flow. Nah, your short form income path, I like that. Great, so now what I can do with these creatives here is I can download those creatives and create a carousel, for example, if I wanted to. And I can use the carousel on platforms like Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. I can use them as ads, which I'm gonna talk about here in just a minute. And then again, by using the specific URL for this offer here, we are ensuring that there's complete alignment between the creative itself and the landing page, which is going to increase conversions for when people click on the content that, we, that we're creating here in Pomeli and then landing on the that sales page there. You want people to feel like, oh, I'm in the right place based on where I just came from, based on the creative I just clicked on. That's key. And now that we have these creatives that we really like, we can move into the next use case I wanna share with you in this video. And that is using Pomeli to do AB ad testing creative creation. For the first nine years of my business, I taught Facebook ads and Facebook ads are all about creative. Testing different creative all the time because Facebook's AI algorithm for the ads has gotten so smart, it will find the audiences for you. Your job is to focus on the creative. So you can use Pomeli to generate five, 10, 15 different on-brand variations of a single campaign idea in a matter of seconds. So again, I can come down here, I can use these if I want to. I can go ahead and click on add creative if I want, describe the creative you wanna create. So I can make Instagram feed ads if I want to, or I can just simply go up here, the three little dots here, go to duplicate, and I can click on square. So let's just go ahead and click square. And now in a matter of seconds, I've created a square version of that ad. 
Another thing I can do is I can go ahead and click on duplicate same size and change the headline or change the, put an add a call to action here or change the description or whatever it is. Change one aspect of the image so that I can A-B test these creative against each other. And before we leave this page, let's talk about use case number five here in the video. And that is using Pomeli to create a swipe file for partners and affiliates. If you're sending affiliates for your offer or for your business, just generic creative that is not tailored to them, you are reducing the number of sales that are possible. You're making your affiliates work too hard, essentially. Well, Pomeli can solve that problem for you. So for example, instead of giving them, again, those generic logos, you can provide them with a full kit of on-brand social posts that they can use immediately, which again, is gonna increase the chances that they'll they'll actually promote you. So what you could do here is you can go in, let's just say that we wanna use this image right here. I can click on it, I can make the changes. So for example, let's just say that I wanted to promote this offer here. I could come in here and edit the description and say, use Pat Flynn's short form formula, a three-step system for predictable revenue with short form video. So this would be a super easy way to take the language that your affiliate partners use in their business. And you've got customized creative for your affiliates. Pomeli makes this super, super easy to do. And here's a bonus use case for you. You can use Pomeli to reverse engineer a competitor's strategy. So all you have to do is input the URL of a competitor. Let's just say, I'm just gonna grab cursor. For example, I'm gonna click on cursor, grab the URL, come over here, I'm gonna paste it in. And so what this can do is this is gonna give you a rare look into a marketing blueprint, if you will, that AI think works for that specific business. And that can help you identify gaps in your own strategy. Okay, and here's the business DNA that is just created for Cursor. And again, you could look through here, especially the brand values, the tone of voice, the aesthetic, et cetera. And now we can use this information to, if this is, if you're a competitor for, if Cursor is a quote competitor of yours, for example, you can use this to identify gaps in your own strategy and give you ideas for your own campaigns for your business. So for example, let's just say that you had not thought about this tagline here of zero bugs for the new year. Well, you could create your own take off this and then create your own campaign here in Pomeli. All right, I hope this video gave you some really good ideas for how you can use Pomeli in your own business. Again, it's totally free. Go into Google's la Google Labs and start using it today. Again, if you're an online business owner and you're looking to leverage AI in your business so that you can work less and make a lot more money in your business, I want to invite you to join us inside my AI playbook community. I'll link to it in the description below. Thanks so much for watching today's video. I'll see you in the next one.